Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, pizza fans of all ages. My name is Mike, and welcome to Pizza Mon Mario. You already know what we're doing today. Another Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl discussion video. More specifically, Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2, if that is your real name, or if you're even real to begin with. This is going to be like a follow-up video to a previous one I did last week, talking about a possible July reveal trailer and also sharing some new information that was brought to my attention. If you want to call it information, because it's just a leak. Now, like I said before, I don't like talking about leaks on the channel, but everybody's talking about it. So, as a Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl fan, I feel like I should too. Real quick though, before I do that, let me just say, Happy July 2023, everybody. My first video of the month. Yeah, it's been uh, five days and I haven't done a video this month yet. No, oh, whatever. Also, if you guys celebrate Independence Day, hope you had a great holiday. And now, let's get into the discussion. So first things first, it was brought to my attention that there was a recent leak indicating that El Tigre from El Tigre, The Adventures of Manny Rivera has been confirmed for Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2. There was even a picture showing off El Tigre using one of his moves. I'm not gonna show it off in this video because I don't wanna get in trouble, but if you look it up, you might be able to find it. There actually was a picture of him, like, stretching out his claw arm, hitting Garfield with it, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, if you look it up, you might possibly find the image. Now, El Tigre is a character that was highly requested for Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 1, and I, too, am someone who wanted to see him in the game. It wasn't in my original top 10, but then once Jenny and Rocco joined the roster, he became part of my new top 10. Now, I'm not too familiar with El Tigre. It's been a long time since I've seen the show. I don't know if I watched it that much. But it is one of the many shows I wanted to go back and give a rewatch to. They really need to put it on Paramount Plus. Like, why is that not on there yet? We have all these other Nicktoons on there. Why is El Tigre not there? All we have is that Amazon Burn On Demand DVD that you can't even get anymore. Because those are discontinued, not a print and all. So they definitely should put the show on Paramount Plus. Especially if he's going to be joining All-Star Brawl 2. So that way people who may not have heard of the show can get familiar with it by watching that Paramount Plus. Come on Nickelodeon or Paramount, whoever is in charge of putting the show on there. Make it happen. And while you're at it, you should go ahead and put Shout Factory on the line and get them to make a complete series DVD set for the show. You know, just saying. Look, I'm getting off topic right now. The point is, El Tigre would be a great addition to the roster, dare I say a must-have for the game. People want to see him in the game, I want to see him in the game. I did a DLC Ideas episode for Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 1 for this character, so that should tell you that I want to see him in the game. Like I said before, I want to see as many franchises from Nickelodeon in the game as possible, especially ones that don't get talked about much, like El Tigre. Well, I probably shouldn't say that, because nowadays, El Tigre is probably talked about a lot, courtesy of Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl. But you know what I mean. You can use a nice balance of representation from each era of Nickelodeon. You know, 90s, 2000s, 2010s, etc. That's all I really need to say about that. But that now brings us to the second topic of this discussion. We've gotten quite a few leaks for Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2 lately. We've got the cover art leak. There's also a follow-up from that that told us about Vlad, Raphael, Jimmy Neutron, and Squidward joining the game. Now this El Tigre leak, not to mention the Squidward leaks from before, and the Danny ones as well, the one with Patrick and The Rock, not Dwayne The Rock Johnson, the one with Patrick holding his rock house and using it as an attack. It does make you think we're destined for a Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2 reveal trailer sometime soon. And we are in July, and I can't think of a more perfect time to reveal the game than the same month that the first Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl was revealed. Now we're halfway through the first week of the month. We still don't have anything yet. Maybe we could see something later tonight, or tomorrow, or the next day, or the next day. Maybe we'll have it next week. Tell the truth, I think it might be more likely we might be seeing something next week. Cause let's look back at Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 1's reveal trailer. It was posted on July 13th, 2021. The second full week of July. See where I'm going with this? We could be in for a little bit of deja vu. You know? 
we could probably get a reveal trailer for Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2 next week. Or it's on that same Tuesday, on the 13th, or any other day that week. But, you know, I'm not here to give you guys false hope or false information. I'm trying to get you guys hyped up for nothing. You know, I ain't no clickbaiter. But I think that's what a clickbaiter would say. On second thought, I am trying to clickbait you. I'm trying to give you false hope. False information, get you hyped up for nothing. <laughs> okay, but jokes aside, this is just a theory, a game theory, that it is a possibility we could get a reveal trailer for Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2 next week. But again, this is all speculation. We could get something this week or next week or week after that, etc. But if you are getting Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2, I really don't see any other time to announce it than in July. Unless they're giving us a different game, like a party game or something. But I'm not sure that's going to be the case. I'm not saying I fully believe all the leaks. Like I'll believe it when I see it, but I'm not going to rule out the possibility, given all these leaks. For now, all we can do is just write this stuff down so we don't forget. Let's say, from this point on, for the sake of discussion, all the leaks that we received so far are real. And we all get Nickelodeon All-Star Ball 2. Who's coming to the game? Jimmy Neutron, Squidward, Live Plasmius, Raphael, and El Tigre. We know there's going to be a new move set, probably, for Patrick. He's going to be having a rock house move. And this doesn't have anything to do with the leaks, but we probably have an idea we're going to be seeing voice acting in the game, as well as possibly crossplay. I think it'd be really weird if the game came out and there was no crossplay. After all this, not to mention there was crossplay in Nickelodeon All Star Brawl 1 early March, but then the like got shut down after a while. Although, from what I heard, it was back in the game. Like, someone was able to play Nickelodeon All Star Brawl 1 with crossplay, like recently. I don't know if that's true or not. I haven't like looked or like heard anything about it, but that's just what I was told, so don't shoot the messenger. But yeah. I see no scenarios why Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2 would not have crossplay on launch. But hey, that's just me talking. We're just chatting up, talking about the future. You know what I'm saying? All I can do now is just leave the question to you guys. So, question of the video. Do you think I want to see El Tigre in Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2? And if we do get a reveal trailer for Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2 this month, when do you think it'll happen? Let me know what you guys think about all this in the comments below. Well, there's no Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl discussion video for you guys today. Hope you all enjoyed it. If you didn't, then, oh well, can't please everybody. Believe me, I know. But all in all, that concludes my first video of July 2023. Look forward to more. Whether it's Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl related, more gaming related stuff, or plush videos, whatever have you. But for right now, it's time for me to hit the road. That's going to be it for today's video. Did you like it? If you did, do me a solid and punch the like button below like a piece of dough. And if this is your first time on this channel, you like what you saw, you want to come back for more, hit that subscribe button to become a member of the Pizza Mind Mario Party today. Share it with your friends your boyfriends, your girlfriends are, or you want to share with. Hit that bell and turn notifications so you can be the first one to see all our current videos. Have a bit of time, leave a comment. Until next time, this is your boy Mike signing out, so peace out y'all, hope you have a great rest of your day. I know I didn't say uh, my snacks and beverages thing again, but oh well. But hey, I got my snack right here. My beverage is somewhere else, I guess. Yeah, my snack for this video, the pack of sweethearts.